Hey guys, today I have something with you, and it's the Glass Armut Display. Oh yeah. <laughs> so, here's the system, it's this armor stand over here with this glass encasing, and it really looks nice in my opinion. Uh, you can have it on your base to, to brag about your armor or something like that to everyone that goes there. But even if no one goes to your base and you still want to brag about your armor, you can just press this button over here which is going to open the display. Then you can take your armor and show it to the world. <laughs> something like that. But if you are done doing that, you can just press the button once again and it's going to revert the system to how it was before and it's going to look amazing again. But yeah, now what I really like about this system is the opening and the closing animation because as you probably already noticed, uh, when the system is closing, it's going to push the the glass blocks into the armor stand, but the armor stand is not going to move. And it's going to do that without having to put a block over here or without having to move the armor stand or make explosions or anything like that. Um, but that's that makes a very seamless and a very clean opening and closing animation, which is very nice. But yeah, uh, I think that's basically it for the system. So now I think we can go with the rest down, shall we? <laughs> so here's the system. It's a pretty big one. Um, if you want to, if you want a simpler version, I'm going to show a, a very simple version in the end of the video. So stick for that. Uh, but this system, I made it together with Cas from the channel Myzuma Games. So uh, be sure to check him out. I'm going to put his channel in the description. But uh, this idea was also. Uh, suggestion from someone on Twitter. I can't remember who. Sorry about that. But thank you for the suggestion anyway. But <laughs> you probably are wondering how I'm making the glass blocks appear in the armor stand. And some people already guessed it on a video I made two days ago, just a teaser video. And you guessed it right that I was using zero tick poses. Right here. And what's controlling the circuit, the zero tick poses, is the circuit right here. And every time I give it a pose, it's going to give a zero tick pose to these pistons right here. And when it does that, it's going to be so fast. The pistons are going to spill the blocks so fast that it's not even going to give uh, time for the for the armor stand to to move, which is pretty useful for stuff like that. And <laughs> but well, going back to the system over here, uh, well, I don't think there's much more about it to say. Uh, if you if you want to compact it, uh, be my guest. Uh, I would very like to see. I would like to see a compacted version of this. And if you make a video, I can even show it on Twitter. Or I don't know. I can I can mention it. Uh, I can mention it on in the description. But well, apart from that, uh, let me just show the simpler design over here. Uh, well, here's the simple design. It's it's just uh, a wall, and every time you press the button, it's going to reveal or hide the armor stand. And well, you can have any many types of armor stands, as many times as you want, as many types as you want. But well, <laughs> I think that's it uh, for the system. So now let me show you the the red snow, which is over here. And well, you probably already saw that it is very simple, a lot more simple than the first design. And you can probably already already build it by just looking at it. But if you want a word download, I'm going to put it on in the description, uh, this design and also the first one. So if you want to take a closer look at both of the designs. Uh, but uh, apart from that, I think that's basically it. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.